Greetings in Christ. Welcome to our channel, The Gifts of God. Wishing you a blessed day in Christ. We hope you enjoy this video and subscribe to this YouTube channel to stay updated with the latest information. Join us on this journey and listen to this video until the very end. Before we begin today's message, let us pray to Mary. O oh Mary, beloved daughter of God the Father, I entrust my spirit to your care. Guard the life of God in my heart. Do not let me lose it through sin. Guard my mind and will so that all my thoughts and desires may be pleasing to God. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. We live in a time where spirituality and faith are constantly challenged. In the face of uncertainties and global crises, humanity is invited to seek refuge and strength in faith, especially in the protection and intercession of the Virgin Mary. This message comes as a breath of hope, an urgent call for unity in prayer, serving as a spiritual guide for the faithful to face the challenges of our time. The spiritual journey requires not only individual faith, but also a deep connection among community members. The message begins with a warm invitation for everyone to unite in prayer, a practice that transcends differences and unites hearts in the search for divine protection. Prayer, as a bridge between the human and the divine, is presented as the main tool for obtaining the guidance and comfort necessary to face uncertain times. This call to prayer is not just a suggestion, but an urgent need in a world marked by conflicts and spiritual disorder. The faithful are called to renew their faith, revive their hope, and join together in a collective effort to invoke the divine protection of the Virgin Mary, the mother who never abandons her children. The message reveals a recent apparition in Medjugorje, a place already known for its powerful spiritual messages. This new revelation is presented not just as a warning, but as a loving guide that directs the faithful toward true faith and unconditional love. It is a reminder that in the midst of darkness and suffering, there is a light that never goes out, the light of faith in God and the intercession of the Virgin Mary. Medjugorje has been a spiritual beacon for many, and this new message serves to reinforce the importance of remaining steadfast in faith, regardless of circumstances. It is a call to conversion, spiritual renewal, and the continuous pursuit of a life lived in love and truth. Pope Francis, as the leader of the Catholic Church, faces enormous challenges in his mission to guide the faithful in such turbulent times. The message makes a touching plea for the protection and strength of the Pope, acknowledging the trials he and the Church are facing. It is a reminder that, despite difficulties, faith and prayer have the power to sustain those who bear the burden of spiritual leadership. The message also highlights the importance of supporting the Pope in his decisions and prayers, recognizing that he is a pillar of the church and that his guidance is essential in confronting the spiritual challenges of our time. We live in a world where evil manifests itself in various forms, from rampant lust to corruption that permeates institutions. The message underscores the spiritual battle that everyone faces, highlighting the need to resist temptations and find refuge in faith and prayer. The decline in religious vocations is pointed out as one of the great crises of our time, reflecting a loss of spiritual focus and an increase in worldly distractions. However, the message is not just a warning. It is also an invitation to reflection and action. The faithful are called to strengthen their spiritual lives, dedicating themselves to prayer and service as a way to combat the forces of evil that seek to divert humanity from the path of righteousness. At the heart of the message is the importance of the Rosary and the Eucharist, described as fundamental pillars of spiritual life. The Rosary is presented as a powerful prayer of intercession, 
capable of bringing healing and peace in times of adversity. The Eucharist, in turn, is the spiritual nourishment that sustains the faithful on their journey of faith. The message emphasizes that, in times of tribulation, it is essential to maintain a regular practice of prayer and participation in the sacraments. These acts of devotion are not just rituals but means of deeply connecting with the divine, finding strength and courage to face life's trials. The message recalls the prophecies of Our Lady of Fatima, which are seen as warnings and promises for humanity. Our Lady of Fatima drew attention to the dangers the world faces and the need for conversion and penance. The current message reinforces this need, highlighting the urgency of strengthening faith to face future challenges. The message of Fatima is a reminder that even in the face of the most terrible adversities, faith in God and the intercession of the Virgin Mary can bring light and hope. It is an invitation for all to turn to prayer, asking for divine mercy and protection against the evils that threaten the world. As the message nears its conclusion, there is a strong invitation to the community to continue engaging in the practice of faith. The faithful are encouraged to subscribe to the channel, participate in prayer, and keep hope and trust in divine protection alive. The message concludes with words of inspiration, reminding everyone that, regardless of the challenges that may arise, faith in God and the Virgin Mary is the anchor that can keep the soul firm and secure. This call to action is not just a formality. It is a genuine appeal for everyone to actively engage in their spiritual journey. In a world full of uncertainties, faith and prayer are the keys to keeping hope alive and finding inner peace. In conclusion, this spiritual message is a powerful appeal for the renewal of faith and unity in prayer. It offers comfort, guidance, and hope to those seeking to strengthen their connection with God and the Virgin Mary in difficult times. The message emphasizes the importance of prayer, participation in the sacraments, and the fight against the forces of evil. It is a call for all the faithful to unite, reinforcing their faith and trust in divine protection as they face life's challenges. The spiritual journey is continuous, and through prayer and devotion, the faithful can find the strength necessary to overcome any adversity. This is a time of trial, but also a time of opportunity, an opportunity to renew faith, strengthen the community, and seek refuge in the loving protection of the Virgin Mary. Thank you for being part of this journey. Your presence and engagement make this exploration meaningful and impactful. Until next time, may you find inspiration and hope in the shared stories of our human experience.